I've often thought to myself that everyone needs a time alone in the solitude of an open world, all their own. So here I am with nothing but a trusty little map and a sense for adventure and exploration. So here we are in this brand new world. What kind of adventures will I get into? What kind of creatures might I face? What kind of world might I build in the solitude of my own imagination? Well, we're starting off here in a desert. We've got some pretty practical resources. Thankfully, we're close to some water. I already see some coal and some copper. I'm not able to mine it yet. I've got to get myself a pickaxe for that. So, a good place to start would be to find some valuable resources to start building some tools. Thankfully, I have some friends here with me. The difficult part about starting in a desert is there's not many trees around. So, I'm going to have to go adventuring a little while until I find some usable wood. The desert can be a sometimes an unkind and unforgiving place to uh, live. Sometimes with monsters. Not much signs of life, but I did find a single mushroom. That might make for a good snack later on if I don't find anything else. I've spotted the structure off yonder in the distance across the water here. And I do see some signs of dirt, which could lead to some usable trees. But I guess I'm just going to have to press on, see what further adventures await across the water. I'm still on the map, so that's a good sign. But will this map lead me to any valuable usable resources? Or just drive me deeper into a unforgiving desert? Thankfully my spirits are high and hopeful. And my sense of adventure sometimes has paid off. In this case, with a broken nether portal, I've heard that there is a another dimension that we can travel to. A dark dimension filled with a lot of ghastly beasts. I don't know if we're quite ready for that adventure yet, but... This might be an important place to keep keep a memory of. We'll get back here again once we have some resources to dig up these obsidian blocks. For now though, let's see what kind of treasures we have here. Hmm. I'll take these golden boots. Nothing better than a fine pair of boots when you're adventuring. I'm finding small patches of grassland, which is a good sign, but there are no trees anywhere in sight, and the sun is setting, and the last place I want to be is an unforgiving desert during the nighttime. With nothing to build a bed, I think I'm going to have to just dig my way into the earth, away from the monsters that will spawn. And me, me, no good intent. Well, it's certainly nighttime in my desert home. I built myself a small little hole in the ground just to keep myself away from the monsters that spawn. And I left myself a little window so I can see the moonlight. 
We didn't find much in the way of resources today. We've re revealed quite a bit of our map so far. But no trees yet. I've got this one red mushroom that looks pretty tasty. Best not eat it by itself though. I could make myself a nice mushroom stew, but I don't have a bowl or a brown mushroom. So I guess I'm holding on to this little red one for a while. I've got quite a bit of dirt. Not much I can do with that, but I can build my way out of something or into something if I get into a sticky situation. Nothing left to do now, but wait out the night. Keep on exploring tomorrow.